Panda? Really? I didn't expect them to release Panda after this, but let's take a look at it. Uh, obviously, we just saw the Kuma one. The big surprise with the Kuma one was that we saw the Bear Fist. I don't forget what it's called already. But that was the big difference, right? So it looked like there was just one move difference. But that trailer was kind of surprised because we saw something new that we hadn't seen before. Similar to the Shaheen trailer, right? So let's take a look. See if this character is any different than Kuma. Other than like maybe a Storming Flower. The Pretty Protector. Panda! Was that a guard break? Damn, I don't, pay, I don't pay attention. I know that the majority of these bear moves are going to be similar. There's a lot of guard breaks here. Does Kuma have those? I want answers. That is a long ass intro. I heard that a uh, hunting bear stance doesn't have the the double low anymore. What in the world was that? The heat smash? That was tight. What the hell? Oh, it's okay. So there's more than just the uh, storming flower. Boom. Circus in town as the rage art <laughs> waving the camera. What the hell? <laughs> you make you Sonic the Hedgehog? There's the AOP there. Very nice, Panda. Very nice. I mean, I think if you're a Panda player, uh, it's probably cute. It's probably the aesthetic you're into. Uh, you know, competitively, move wise, the move they showed repeatedly there was always the. The charged up attack, right? So this one right here. Big charge. It does chip damage for sure. And then Asuka's hitting a bunch, so this isn't guaranteed. Again, same situation. I wonder if... Um, it's actually weird that they showed us that twice in a row, right? Rewind bigger. Is it the exact same move that they showed twice in a row? No, it's different. Because that time was on a hunting bear stance, right? And this first time, I'm pretty sure it was just in neutral. Yeah. So they are different. Oscar tried to forward two, it looked like. And this time, from a hunting bear stance. Boom, into charge up again. Yeah, hard to tell if Asuka is actually swinging into that one there. Let me take a look. Let's slow it down just a notch. Drop the volume. She's hitting a button, it looks like. One more time. Pretty sure she's hitting a button, so it's just plus frames. 442 launch. That's this cool screw attack, actually. Hunting Bear Stance Power Crush for the balcony break. Nothing new there. Got the same Hayachi string that Kuma has. Got this long intro. And then we got to see the heat stuff, right? So let's see. Launcher, heat burst. Boom, boom. Very straightforward there. Heat engager. What in the world? That is so tight, actually. That's the heat smash, right? That's tight, though. They hit you with the, uh, the beach ball. <laughs> it's pretty good. Power crush heat engager is probably going to be good in this game, to be honest. That is funky, dude. So she's got shooting star. Ling Xiaoyu shooting star lands on her butt in basically a bear city, it looks like. 
wow, that's the guard break out of the roll now. Uh, there's been a lot of crazy combo videos on Twitter with this guard break. Heat dash. And that's the Rage Art again. So pretty straightforward, nothing too crazy. I am surprised they released the Bear trailer back to back, essentially. That's kind of wild. Whoopsie. But there you have it. That's Panda. Easy so easy. Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, and that's the, the storming flower there. That's interesting. Wait, I missed AOP again. <laughs> AOP's hard, bro. So the rage art is where the storming flower is? Hold up. And the AOP there. Circles it down, turns into Sonic the Hedgehog. And then the Storming Flower is the finish, right? Boom! So that was from the Rage Art only. So only the sh uh, Shooting Star is the Ling Xiao Yu move that she has in uh, Heat. Interesting. Well, there you have it. Panda! Tekken 8. Boom. Nice and short. Nice and sweet. Subscribe!